What's going on guys? Just bringing you a really quick news flash about Monetize Coin. So they've just sent out this announcement that their internal exchange will be launched tomorrow on the 28th of February. And the time is at 5 p.m. GMT. At the bottom here, they actually have a list of times so you can find your local time to see when that's actually going to be launched. So this has actually been um, delayed slightly, as they mentioned here. It was meant to be go live on the 24th of February, but they have spent the extra time making sure that everything is ready to go. They didn't want to face any of the same problems that um, pretty much every other platform I've seen launch has had. Um, so I think that's a, a really good thing, and I'm glad they took the time to do that rather than rush it out for the sake of it. Now, there's some really good information here, um, which I wasn't aware of beforehand. And, uh, I mean, it sounds really good um, for the future of Monetize. So I'll point out a couple of things, but you can come and uh, read this here yourself um, in the Monetize Telegram. Um, I'll also I'll copy and paste this into a pinned comment below as well. So just getting into it. Um, one of the first things they mention is uh, the fact that their internal exchange is actually going to match orders um, cross currency. So basically, if you put in a sell order for monetized coin um, to receive Bitcoin, um, your your sell order can still be fulfilled by someone that's buying in with Ethereum. So as I say here, it doubles the liquidity pool for the exchange, and it um, it basically means that your sell order is likely to go through much quicker, and that anyone else, anyone's buy order will go through much quicker as well. Um, and the way that works is um, basically they are internally um, going to exchange the currency um, in order to fulfill that order and that is going to be at no extra cost to the user um, they're going to foot that bill themselves um, just to improve the system so that's the first really awesome thing to note and uh, they mention here that the exchange uses the maker taker model um, so here are the here are the fees that we will be charged for for any um, exchange orders. It's um, 0.25 percent uh, for <clears throat> uh, limit orders and market orders, 0.35 percent. So it's a pretty low fee. So the next um, big thing is that um, any reference to lending um, with monetize is going to be referred to as campaigns, and essentially. Anyone is going to be able to log into the monetized system and initiate a campaign um, that goes out and generates profits for them based on the whole monetization system that they will be using in the background, um, the monetized bot as we know it. They're working on making this a really simple process for people as well so that it's just a couple of clicks and you have a campaign up and running and generating you money. The the rewards um, for these campaigns will work exactly the same as lending though, so nothing has changed there. We should still be expecting the same amount of return for our investments into Monetize. The next big thing is that the, this campaign system uh, is going to launch just 48 hours after the internal exchange. So that will be on the 2nd of uh, March, I believe. So that's a really quick turnaround. They go on to mention here that they are not offering any special rates for people that um, enter their um, monetized tokens into um, campaigns early on um, because they have seen that this doesn't work based on what other platforms have done. Um, any artificial manipulation of the price tends to backfire and I think that is a sound decision. And any natural growth is always going to be better for the platform in the long run. So I'd assume, jumping over to the website here, I would assume that the uh, exchange is going to open up um, at 251, sorry, 257, uh, which was the um, last price um, during the ICO.
Personally, I will not be selling any of my tokens just yet. Uh, I don't have all that many anyway, um, but I, um, I believe this platform is going to do quite well. Um, I certainly hope it does. So I'm going to be holding on to all my tokens and putting them into campaigns and staking them. Um, my all my tokens are currently um, in staking. You can see here that they're, they're still maturing. I put them in uh, six days ago. It must have been because there is four days left before they mature and start paying out. Now I'm not too bothered about that because I don't feel the need to put them into a campaign straight away because obviously there's no uh, benefit to doing that as you've just heard. So I'll um, I'll leave them staking for I don't know a week or two. I'll see how things go, see how the platform progresses, and how um, how other people get on with uh, campaigns, and then I'll think about taking some out of my stake and um, put them into campaigns. Um, also, actually, on that note. Um, one of my subscribers actually commented on a previous monetized video with uh, a really great idea actually uh, about staking which um, I thought I'd just share so <clears throat> basically you can see here I've put all my coins into um, one staking pool so if I cancel this obviously I get all my all these coins back plus any um, staking returns after 14 days now, what happens if I wanted to actually leave some in, but just use and, and just use a bit to um, put into a campaign? Well, I'd have to cancel it all, and then if I didn't use all of them, I'd have to restake them, and I'd have to wait that wait for that uh, maturing period again, um, which is a bit of a pain. So, um, what this guy suggested is, uh, and what he did was actually create multiple stakes um, in smaller denominations. So maybe, um, you know, five stakes of, of 50 is what, what I could have done. And then if you just wanted to um, put, you know, 100 tokens into a campaign, then you just cancel two of those staking pools and you've still got the rest in there <coughs> earning you um, daily staking returns. So <clears throat> it's a really great tip, um, and I don't think it affects your your overall returns. So it's definitely worthwhile testing that out if you've not yet put any staking in and it's something you want to do. Just jumping back to the Telegram message. So although they won't be doing any um, special um, campaign rates, what they are going to do is actually incentivize users to enter their tokens into a campaign um, by doing a giveaway and basically for every token that you enter into a campaign um, that will buy you a ticket in a raffle to receive up to ten thousand um, dollars paid directly into your account um, as you can see here in Bitcoin or Ethereum um, with no hold on it, it will, you'll be able to take that away straight away if that's what you wanted to do. Um, so it is, um, I think that's a really good idea. <clears throat> Obviously it doesn't um, affect their exchange or platform in any way, but it's still a huge incentive for anyone, um, especially if you're going to be staking a lot of coins, because obviously the more you stake, the uh, more tickets you have, and the greater chance you have to potentially receive this giveaway. <clears throat> so um, next they just go on to talk about their um, plans for the future, um, marketing being one of them. They're going to hit the marketing hard once um, everything's up and running and going smoothly. Uh, there'll be a mobile app um, released at some point in the future um, for you know campaign creation on the move so that's really good. Yeah, they talk here about um, instant campaign buys. So as I said before, you know, just one button to um, to build a, a campaign that's going to generate you uh, a return starting straight away. 
And uh, what's really great about this is that any new investors coming into the platform, um, when they, you know, they, they have to buy monetize tokens in order to run these campaigns, and those tokens will always be coming from our own supply. So we'll always, if we have um, tokens on the exchange, um, I believe this is, I, I've understood this correctly anyway, if you have uh, open orders on the exchange to sell monetized tokens and a new investor comes in wanting to buy so that he can set up a campaign, monetize themselves um, will go ahead and buy those tokens from you um, and um, pass them on to the new investor without that being obvious. So that all happens in the background. The investor just, as far as he's aware, he's just coming in and buying tokens from monetized themselves. Um, but we're actually having our orders fulfilled. So that's really good news for existing investors. So yeah, you can see here, they say that um, once everything's rolled out and uh, running smoothly, they will start promoting uh, a lot bigger. And, um, you know, they have every intention of making monetize a hundred dollar coin um, but without you know creating this sort of short-term platform that just crashes after a couple of months so yeah a really great update from them I'll just open this screen again just so you can have a look at it whilst I sign out um, I think there's a bright future ahead for monetize um, as I said in one of my previous videos it's going to be interesting to see how this all works out with the the monetization of, of web traffic model, um, considering the competition that is out there. But um, I think it's it's a great idea, and it's something that um, not many other ICOs have done or are offering. You know, it's there's a real business behind this, so <clears throat> they've got um, real room for um, expansion to do well. So. Um, yeah, uh, if you're not already in Monetize, then um, you can uh, go ahead and sign up and buy on the external exchange um, tomorrow. Um, I'll drop a link below, as always. Um, that will be my affiliate link if you want to use that to sign up. Um, but otherwise, you can uh, just head over to their uh, main website at Monetize Coin. Uh, but that's it for this one, guys. I uh, hope that's been a useful update for you. Thanks again for tuning in, and I will see you in the next one.